Vice President Kamala Harris and former President Donald Trump will be in Texas today. They'll both focus on issues they hope will hit home with voters across the country. Yeah, Fox 4's Dan Godwin joins us in the studio with the latest on the presidential race. Dan. Tizia Election Day will be here in 11 days. Texas is a solidly Republican state, but the Harris campaign looking to highlight an issue it believes will help them throughout the country. Vice President Harris arrived in Houston last night. She will host a rally there today focused on abortion rights. Democratic Congressman Colin Allred will join her. He is challenging Republican U.S. Senator Ted Cruz for his seat. The rally will be centered around Texas women who have suffered from the from this state's restrictive abortion ban. It is a message aimed to extend beyond the Texas border. Superstar and Houston native Beyonce is expected to perform at the rally. Harris's presidential campaign has taken on Beyonce's 2016 track Freedom as its anthem. A Harris rally yesterday in Georgia featured appearances by stars including Bruce Springsteen and Samuel L. Jackson as well as former President Obama. Harris's address included a critique of Donald Trump's economic plan. Donald Trump will raise costs on you and your families. In fact, independent economists have analyzed our plans and found that mine will cut your costs and strengthen our economy. We have to win, and we don't need it for the big political event. We need it to save our country. Former President Trump spoke to supporters in the swing state of Arizona on Thursday, where he has a small lead over Harris. Trump went after the Biden-Harris administration's immigration policies. Today, Trump will be in the Texas state capitol. He's expected to be joined by Senator Ted Cruz at a news conference focusing on border security. Afterwards, he will record a podcast interview with Joe Rogan in Austin. The Joe Rogan Experience is Spotify's most popular podcast. Harris's campaign says she is skipping an interview with Rogan due to her schedule. Meanwhile, the Trump campaign is planning a massive event this weekend in New York City's Madison Square Garden. Dan Godwin on Good Day.